A Vancouver Island senior is speaking out tonight saying broken and cracked pieces of teeth have been falling out of her mouth. She blames the province for denying her applications for emergency dental care. CTV's Ben Milger has more on the woman's predicament. So this one right here, that's half a tooth that came out of my mouth. In the last year and a half, several teeth, old fillings and a crown have fallen out of Doreen G's mouth. The 72-year-old says she needs expensive dental care to save the few teeth she has left. I can't chew my food properly and most food that's nutritious, as you know, is hard. Um, so I'm limited in, I can't even eat I have a hard time eating nutritious food. Her Canada pension and it's old age security hard. make up most of her income. She's eligible for $1,000 of dental work every two years, but it only covers limited procedures such as fillings and extractions. She has applied for emergency dental care from the province, seeking coverage for crowns to save her remaining teeth and says she's been denied each time. Beyond frustration, I'm angry and I'm fed up. The Ministry of Social Development and Poverty Reduction did not make anyone available for an interview or provide a statement. It says it spends $53 million a year on dental care for 128,000 people. So many people, thousands and thousands of seniors and others, are going through what I'm going through now, and I'm speaking for them as well as myself. I mean, we should not have to live the last chapter of our lives with our teeth falling out of our head and ashamed to smile. The federal government has a plan to expand dental coverage for low-income Canadians, but G worries she'll lose more teeth before that happens. Ben Milger, CTV News, Vancouver.